How important are vocals to your recordings? Think about this factoid. Basically, everybody knows how home and project studios have gone you know, from being super complicated and very, very expensive to kind of just like this, just a computer, a preamp, some monitors, and a microphone. We're basically recording using the same computers, DAWs, plugins, loops, and patches. And most of these sounds are becoming, you know, really kind of plug and play and so foolproof. But the one thing that remains, the, the most difficult to master happens to be, guess what? The most important thing in your mix, and that is your vocals. How you record them, how you arrange them, how you EQ them, how you compress them, how you affect them, and how you build them all together to build massive, lush, harmonies. There's really no magic one-click plugin that gets you the kind of vocals that you dream of. Just the tried and true best practices of recording killer vocals that have been practiced in basically every major studio over generations. My name is David Wells and I've had the good fortune of working with some of the best vocalists in the world, not the least of which was Whitney Houston. Now apart from working on her world tours. I worked with her for, gosh, over 10 years, I'd say. I've personally remixed a number of her hits, working with arguably one of the best voices in pop history. Now, if that's one part of my life, but I also work in my own small home studio using these same best practices with a very, very basic voice, and that is my own. If I can show you how to arrange your vocals using this very average voice to go from this along the way, along the way, along the way. Mm, imagine going from that to this. Along the way, along the way. But at the end of the day, you are, you've got my. you fell into my arms just at the right time Imagine how the quality of your vocals could be skyrocketed to a whole new level. So follow along as we go through the very anatomy of your vocal cords and how to take care of them, also how to warm them up, and then to arrange them into harmonies from uh, chord shapes, intervals, and inversions within your own song. I'll take you step by step showing you how to lay down killer vocals and edit using a ton of advanced techniques that build one upon the other to give you the kind of vocals that you dream of all by using just a simple $100 microphone and a two or $300 a preamp. And it doesn't matter what you work on. These principles work in, in all major DAWs or even standalone recorders. So before you think about investing in the next new hot, I don't know, thousand dollar microphone, thinking that will fix everything, think about how a very small investment in this training will give you just a lifetime of professional vocal uh, results. Oh, and by the way, as a bonus, I have an exclusive interview with Andrew Sheps right here. He's up on my monitor right now. Award-winning mixing engineer whose work with Adele earned him a Grammy. He reveals all of the tips and tricks working with the biggest vocalists in the world. That will be yours free uh, within the course. So go ahead and take a look at all the subjects covered and click on the buy now button and I'll see you in the masterclass in killer vocals training. Ciao for now.